Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. It has been quite some time since I've done one of these, but today we are doing a grocery haul. It's going to be probably a bit of a fortnightly grocery haul for October. It might be mainly just the staples because there is going to be... Oh, the lighting. Go this way. Um, these are just going to be the staples for the month of October because I am going to be doing a big... Costco trip in the coming weeks to prepare for baby and getting a bunch of bulk food in preparation to do some um, freezer meals. So those are new videos coming to you in the future. But today, as you can see behind me, there's a bit of a mess because we've just come back from a camping trip. But um, yeah, let's just show you what I've picked up for the next fortnight-ish. <laughs> Have a bunch of clean dishes over here that we're just gonna ignore but um, first things I guess we'll start off with is this side which is our snacks carbs side of things I mean yeah snacky side of things we've got some two some new potato chips to try these maple glazed bacon and cheddar um, potatoes potatoes these maple glazed bacon and cheddar chips um then there's these tortilla chips which are tangy roast tomato relish which i'm interested to try we might have like a mexican themed food night and have them with it we'll see um sweet and salty popcorn which is my favorite type of popcorn i will very unlikely i will get any of these though because it's a favorite in this house um, and then two packets of shapes, just the cheese and bacon shapes and the cheddar ones. A packet of spaghetti because we were out. A roast chicken because we're going to have chicken and salad for lunch today. Um, then the meats we got. Uh, we got about a kilo of minced beef. Then we got some chicken breasts, which I think again is about a kilo. And a small pork roast, which will be fine for us. And then leftovers will be for lunches. Then we got some um, Red Delicious, I think these were, apples, a big bag of those, um, some green apples, some carrots, a punnet of strawberries, which will be gone in a day, <laughs> um, another punnet of blueberries, and a big bag of green grapes. Oh, excuse me, out of breath. Pregnancy is catching up to me quite a bit, but these were expensive. I don't like spending... 14 16 even I've seen them at $18 for a bag of grapes. These ones were $14.99. I don't like spending that much on grapes, but I really wanted grapes, so I did. <laughs> um, then I got a packet of steam fresh, steam fresh veggies and a mixed vegetable packet for cooking um, a quarter of a watermelon, watermelon slice. I don't know piece of watermelon <laughs> and avocado because I've been loving avocado cheese on toast with mayo that's like my favorite thing but then I've been putting it on bagels lately and that's been amazing um, a salad mix a Caesar salad mix which is gonna go with the chicken over there for our lunch um, a big bunch of bananas which got a little bit beaten up in the process of getting home some a Yo Play For Me, zero, no added sugar, yogurt, no fat even, I don't know that, I don't really care about, but I have to be careful with how much sugar I have, which I um, explained a bit more in my first trimester update, um, which would have been the video before this, which I will have linked above here. Yeah, that's my table. <laughs> then we picked up um, three hand soaps because we have one in the kitchen, one in the, each bathroom. Um, the third one will be a spare, but we were out in the kitchen and out in the ensuite in our master bed bathroom. <laughs> then my partner picked up some Lynx, Lynx, yep, Lynx body wash. We got a new jar of jam, a small jar of peanut butter, smooth peanut butter. And behind here, there is some peach slices in juice and some sustagen, which is uh, like a, a milk adder additive i it's, i don't know i don't like the word additive but like you add it to milk and it flavors the milk but it's got vitamins and iron and things in it that is better than just chucking in like a flavor 
for milk for for um, Sebastian. Two Maximuses in the grape flavor. Two bottles of um, Diet Right um, Cordial because this is what I tend to drink over a lot of things with water. Um, a bottle of apple juice and a bottle of the uh, orange juice, I think it is. Then we got a jar of sweet and sour, a jar of sweet soy and garlic, which is really, really good with chicken as a stir fry. And then two jars of the Legos bolognese sauce, which is our favorite um, bolognese sauce. Then we got four packets of um, low sugar jelly because I figured why not have something a little bit different. And I think my little man might enjoy some um, jelly as a dessert or treat, but we got it in lime, port wine, strawberry, and I think the other one was raspberry. Then we got a packet of Sultana brand buds, which are something we haven't tried before, but I figured um, Sebastian may like, but it's a bit healthier than a lot of cereals. I avoid completely buying sugar covered cereals. It's just not good. Every now and again, it's fine, I guess, for a bit of fun, but I just tend to avoid it completely. And then um, my partner decided he wanted to try these oat crisp um, honey and macadamia um cereal for something different and then the only thing that we didn't get that's the only thing that i got that's not up here is this giant bag of potatoes which we needed because we were completely out of and that is everything that we picked up for this grocery haul thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next one which will be Hopefully the Costco grocery haul um, in the future. But either way, you'll see me in my next video. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you later.